All right, welcome back. So you'll get a kick out of this one, Derek. Mm -hmm. As they say in the bayou, bye you. So, this mission is actually impossible. Well, it's not impossible, but it's stupid hard. Uh, I can already tell. On the PS3 HD remake, and uh, you'll, I'll, I'll explain why. Whoa. Okay, that one was a little close. There it comes. Those dancing chickens, though. Not much. Just a little game I like to play with all my annoying guests. I want to see how well you pay attention. What do you mean? Well, I'll unleash my mighty mojo magic upon you. If you repeat what I do, you'll dodge it just fine. If not, you'll get slapped! <laughs> A little voodoo Simon Says, huh? Sounds easy enough. Quick, grab the Simon Says machine! <laughs> it's like... Doot doot doot. So on PlayStation 3, this is actually impossible, because it's not in time with the music at all. Oh, that's... That's bad. Yeah. Ah, oh, fuck, my buttons for some reason didn't work. Anyways, um... So what you have to do is you literally just go and like Everything. hope it. Yeah, you mash the shit out of it and hope that God it fucking works. That's uh, obnoxious. This is a little hard for me because I have a little bit of input delay um, from the capture and uh, also I can barely hear the sounds for this game, so we can record it without a stupidly high echo. <laughs> Yeah, this is not super easy. Um, it's either so if you if you have really good timing, which is gonna timing. be really hard because again I have all these fucking bullshits that are uh, working making against it, you, working against me. But uh, this was dumb. Okay, we're good. <laughs> but uh, uh, this is like either the easiest boss in the game or the hardest boss in the game, depending on how good you are at timing. Timing. Button presses. You skip this or nah? Uh, yeah, I think so. Maybe not. <laughs> nah, so you might have been able to if you didn't get a game over. But we got a game over, so. That's true. I remember that was one of the. We had a cutscene though. It, we didn't record it, but yet we, we were going back through a part. We got a cutscene, and you were just like, "Can we skip cutscenes?" I was like hitting all the buttons. I was like, "Nope." And then, you and then I like, like started mashing him. I was like, oh, maybe I... Oh, no, it wasn't this game. It was the other game we were playing. Oh, yeah, we were in Juju. Yeah. We were like... I was just like, nope, doesn't look like we can skip it. And then, like, halfway through the cutscene, I just mashed all the buttons in frustration from watching the cutscene. And then it just skipped. And we were like, okay, I guess you can skip them. <laughs> Alright, rhythm game, Chris. Do it. Oh, 
I don't know if Derek was watching me, but I'm actually like he is nodding he's, he's in I'm I'm nodding in rhythm to try and keep up with it. There's more of it. Yes. Oh fuck! That was dumb. I hit circle instead of triangle for some reason. I thought so circle have to, was we, next. We have to go all the way back, don't we? No, I think we start from this section. Oh, I am hella wrong. We have to go all the way back from the beginning. Okay. This is gonna be a long. So I've Hopefully noticed, this will I've, be the last one. I've noticed the patterns are all, all the same. They're always the same, yeah. So they actually are saying voodoo for triangle notes. <laughs> it gets intense, but yeah, end, I was yeah. just letting you do it because I knew you would. Ha <laughs> so I was, I was just gonna let you like do that without interrupting. Yeah. And I had we're something I was going to say, but I've already forgotten what it was. <laughs> Pioneering ancestor, oh, yeah, slight in common. His invisibility technique allowed huh. him to steal from corrupt pharaohs and greedy nobles. Oh, okay, it wasn't. Right on schedule, Inspector Fox's arrival cued my exit. The production of zombies, made illegal in the World Peace Accord of 71, earned Ms. Ruby a life sentence behind bars. What that line. <laughs> While the gang and I enjoyed a few weeks in the tropical sunshine. Working on our tans in preparation for our next caper. <sighs> All right. Um, was it about the uh, the speed of which it gets at the end? Oh, it might have been. Anything there? Um, that was like fucking fuck you at the end. Yeah, it gets a. Uh, it gets pretty goddamn ridiculous at the end because it's just like the first one that was like. 
triangle, tri uh, yeah, triangle, triangle, triangle. I was just like, oh god, that's way faster than I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> when it like cut back to me. Panda King. Um, let's see. So this is the Panda King. Born penniless, he was fascinated by the fireworks rich noblemen set off every New Year's. He spent a decade learning the art. But when he tried to offer his fireworks to the noblemen, they couldn't see past his shabby clothes and chased him away. Humiliated, the Panda King took revenge on those who shunned him by using the very tools of his art for crime. The Fetish Five recruited him as their demolitions expert, and from then on, his explosive touch became feared worldwide. He's rumored to be perfecting some new firework technique high in the unstable Kunlun Mountains of western China. He doesn't sound like a thief to me, he sounds like a terrorist. <laughs> thief, terrorist, same thing. <laughs> he uses his terrorism to steal things, Derek. Sly Cooper in! Fire, Fire in, in the, the sky! sky. I love that. Yeah, right? It's sick, right? So, um... Panda King is the easiest boss in the entire fucking game. Oh? By, like, a long shot. We'll see when we get there. Uh, yeah, I was gonna wait until we were at it, but you know what? It's funnier to just say it now. I guess, I guess that's fine. Okay. <laughs> oh, hello. Um... I like that there's a little, like... Yeah. There's... This is either the first level or... The hub world? Mm hmm It's the first level, I think. Yeah, it's the first level. And then we get to the hub world after completing the first level? Yes. I like that. To it, an extent. It's pretty good. This is like a... I really like its system that it has in place for, like, world building. Where you, like, you start off, like, getting into the actual area. Oh. Dead village. Oh my oh. gosh, that's awful! That poor village just got buried in freezing snow! Rocket came from that giant Oh no. It's okay. Their deaths mean nothing in the grand scheme of the universe. <laughs> to Sly, they really mean nothing. <laughs> but like, that sucks. Yeah, right? It would be a really unfortunate way to go out. Oh god, okay. I wasn't so convinced I could jump over those. I'm so, not gonna lie. are we gonna get to uh, when the cop arrests him? And it's like, yeah, and you know, being a terrorist is illegal, so they arrested him for being a terrorist. <laughs> and for, destroying villages. Pretty much. <laughs> okay. I was like, why does this have like a thing here, but not here? Oh, uh, so, um. It's probably old news, mm -hmm. but I've been watching um, the speed runs they do on. Uh... Oh, there's my invisibility, by the way. Nice. Is it Games Done Quick? Is that what it's called? Yes, Games Done Quick. For uh, Doctors Without Borders. Yes. I was watching those because they've been last month. The ones they did for the beginning of the year have been mm -hmm. uploaded. Yes. So I was watching. I've been watching some of those. And... I know. I know. I have them. <laughs> oh, good. I'm glad. They're I'm beautiful. I just gotta say. Oh, yeah. I... My only... I, I don't like the people who run the event, but I do like their cause, so... Yeah, no, it's pretty cool. Um... Yeah, I don't know. Some of them are... Some of the announcers have been like, I I do not find any interest in how you talk. Yep. Control being funny again? Yep. The game just, like, paused itself. I didn't do that, yeah. I swear. <laughs> But I was watching one of them, and it was, uh, the Majora's Mask. I f I'm blanking on who, who was, uh, doing it. But, um, uh... Yeah. But it was a Majora's Mask 100% speed, uh, playthrough. Yeah. You gotta go around. Yeah, I know, I see it. 100% uh, uh, playthrough. And the dynamic between the person running the game and the guy who was reading the donations was on point. Oh, I can make it. Yeah, oh yeah. It was the funniest shit. Because he's just like, you know, a six minute cu uh, cutscene, non skippable cutscene coming up. Get ready. And, uh, and the announcer was just like, ooh, ooh, yeah. <laughs> you know, I love those words. He's like, uh, there, there's some, I don't know what it is. Some people, like, I feel like are allowed to get away with more than other people at the shows. 
It was the funniest thing. So, like, some people end up being really... My, my whole problem with Awesome Games Done Quick, right, or Games Done Quick, is mm-hmm. uh, the people who run it are so set on being super family-friendly image that, like, the right to the point where a lot of the runners, I feel like, aren't allowed to be funny anymore. Yeah, probably. And, like, it just bugs me because I watched... If you watch, like, old GDQ and then watch new GDQ, you realize there's, like, way less jokes being made because of fear of, like, being banned and, like, no one's allowed to swear and fucking... Oh, uh, one of and them... it's, like, super annoying to me. One of them was, like, I, uh... He said something like, I gotta go... Uh, we gotta get this donation because it lets me go pee. Yeah. And, uh... He said something like, oh, there, go- there we go, I'm fired. Yeah. So that's probably stems from that. Yeah, that's exactly what it. That's exactly what he's talking about. Cause it, it's just so weird to me because it's like, their their logic behind it makes no sense because they're like they don't want people swearing because they don't want the runners to like, be associated with that because they're for a good cause yet they'll play like violent video games on there that have swearing in them. I think one of them made and a the, comment about yeah, that. It's it's really dumb. They're also um. I they mean, won't. They won't let you. Uh, if you if you play if you speed run God of War, you can't go to GD. They won't let you run it. Oh. Yeah, you're not allowed to run. Uh, oh, because I mean that game. Because is... well, no, the reason is because there's sex in it. Yeah. But if you're speed running the game, you avoid it. You probably. don't. Yeah, you don't do any of the sex things. That sucks. Uh, you don't do any of the sex shit because you're speed running it. That all the all the sex scenes in the game are fucking optional. Oh, so yeah. why would you do that for a speed run? Cause uh, you know, why not? I'm curious if this will work. I think so. Oh, okay. I don't have a hitbox when I'm like. So this is that's invisible. probably what you're supposed to be doing here. Yes, you are correct. Cause they were like, you got a new power. Try it out. <laughs> oh crap. I didn't realize it wasn't working until it was too late. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so this area kind of fucking sucks. I'm not gonna lie. Um, just specifically this area, though. But. Ah, oh, fuck you. Fuck you, 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 Right. How long did it take you to figure this stuff out? Dude, this is so fucking horseshit. What it what the hell? I can't turn invisible because You're a I can, I can. Dude, you, you I know, I like scene. literally hit him from behind and it doesn't I, fucking is count. Is it is it supposed to be just like you're supposed to just like sneak your way through this? Yes. And not kill any of them, I guess. I mean, probably, but it's easier to kill them. I, I say as I've died multiple times. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, fun stuff. Funny stuff. Ha <laughs> ha. But, uh, but yeah, GDAQ is pretty fun to watch. Especially, like, especially if they're running a game that you actually like. Yeah, I was watching Majora Masks, and I was just like, this is good. And they did a couple more of the games that I liked. was like, I'll watch these, too. And then by the end of the day, you were just like, Jesus Christ, it's been nine hours. Yeah, basically. Because <laughs> the Majora's Mask is, uh... It's like every time. It's a six hour game, I think, or something like that. Maybe five? I watched, years ago, I watched a speed run of, uh, and still like my favorite one they ever did, and it was, uh, some guy ran Twilight Princess. Mm-hmm. Like. 100%? Not 100%, but it's still like. Any percent? Yeah, but it's still like a fucking, like, three, four hour game. Yeah. Without that. So, like... I know there was one more I at the start of the area. It's... Right over there. Yes. But then we've missed two t- as well. Where was the one at the start of the One area? right there. Okay, this one. 
And I don't know if there was any more that we missed. There probably is, although there might be even further back now if it's gone. Yes. Yeah. Um, but, uh, yeah. Yeah, okay. Oh, well. well. What? Gotta keep, gotta keep rolling, 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 rolling. Have we been what? able to do that rolling, forever? Rolling, rolling, rolling. We got this ability a while ago from one of those safes. Ah. It's just, like, not Silly. helpful in any way. It's, yeah. They're like, you can roll at incredibly fast speeds with it. You literally roll as fast as you run. That's what it seems like. <laughs> yeah, it's so stupid. Inside the sanctuary. But yeah, that one was really early, uh, GDAQ, when people were still allowed to be, like, funny. I just remember the run was like a riot back in the day. Still allowed to be funny. Yeah. You're not allowed to be funny anymore. No one's allowed to have fun anymore. Everyone has to conform to my 100% uh, perfect moral compass. This is not allowed on my Christian server. <laughs> this is what life is slowly becoming. And I hate I'm, it. And it's gonna, it's gonna be the worst thing ever someday. Where am I going? Oh, I see it. I'm fucking... Chris, how dare you on my Christian server? My Christian server. We play a lot of Christian games, actually. Like all, literally, most of the games we play are like kid games. <laughs> True. But it's not because uh, we like playing kid games. It's because they're literally the games I grew up with. So I'm gonna play them. <laughs> yeah. It's... And because I like them. <laughs> we. King of the Hill, Derek. I don't know how to feel about that show. Um, oh, it's, it's another it's, one of these levels. It's not so bad. I like. I don't like it as much as all the other fucking adult cartoons that they have, though. Yeah. Right on. I'll keep him covered. <laughs> so my girlfriend's parents sell uh, propane. Yes. And they were finally introduced. Wait, propane to and propane accessories. Yep, they were finally introduced to that show. They're like, this is incredibly accurate. Oh. Why did you shoot him? I didn't mean to shoot him. He moved right into my bullet. Which is why I will never be able to join the army. Because I will literally shoot my own teammates for getting in the way of my bullets. And then not feel bad about it. <laughs> because they should have known better. Oh, I got you. We got him, the Murray. We got you, the Murray. Bingo! Okay. Bingo! Apple cider! 25 gallons of rice on sale! Okay. This is actually kind of difficult because of the inverted controls. Never been a fan of inverted oh. controls. Unless I'm playing a flying game, in which case it's fine. So I was telling you about it before, but mm -hmm. the Spyro remake get to the get to the flying world in the remakes. Yeah, and I just went nope. <laughs> inverted controls and everything, dude. Inverted controls are like. I don't know. In some cases, it's fine. Like, I don't mind it when it comes to... I don't mind it when it comes to, uh... Like, flying. Because it's like, alright, it's like a plane. Then again, I've also flown a plane before, so... It's probably half the reason why I'm used to that. I forgot that? Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah, I've flown a plane before. It's a small passenger plane, not like a... Fucking 747 jetliner or something. No, nope, it was the jetliner. Yeah, that's what it was. Fucking damn it! Oh, okay, I was actually mad about that because it was right at the end. And yeah. I had to do the whole goddamn thing again. Move, <sighs> shoot the rocket before it gets them. Yes. Okay. I'm also trying to remember where people are coming One from. One comes out from behind him. Jesus. One comes from in front of him. One comes out of the house. Oh, no, and then the house. And then the house. 
Then we go up the stairs. One that comes up from behind the tree. Or not? Nope. He comes up from here and over there. Advanced game tech. I mean, normally you can kind of tell where they're gonna come from, like oh, yeah. before it gets there. It's just that it's annoying. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. No. Good shooting. Good shooting. There's like a weird one, right? Nah, uh, there's a, a big guy who comes up right there. Yes. Okay. And then two will come out of this house on the other opposite sides. No. Alright, what's the last piece of horse shit? Nothing? I knew there'd be one. On the roof. Oh my god, I see it. I knew there was gonna be last one last thing of horseshit that I not call you it. You called it. I called it. I was like, I don't even remember this mission. I was like, f <laughs> it's like, and I'm like, there's gonna be one more thing of bullshit. Oh shit, we're over time. All right, hold on. All right, we'll pick this up on the next part. We'll see you then. Peace.